Hey fam, welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, my name is Carolyn Ann and my channel is a lifestyle channel where you will follow us in our journey to becoming debt-free as well as financially stable. In today's video, we will be closing out our third paycheck in June and going over our last paycheck in June. If you are interested in this type of video, please stay tuned. But first, I'd like to thank all my new subscribers. Hey fam, welcome to the team. And to all my old subscribers, hey fam, welcome back. So let's get started and let's see how we did. So in our paycheck from June 14th to June 20th, in our expense category, we budgeted $179.78 for our chiropractor, $83.88 for our YouTube TV, $50.64 for our homeowner's warranty, $28 for Terminex, $25.06 for Netflix, and $16.19 for Amazon Prime. That came up to $383.55. In our actual category, we paid $179.78 for our chiropractor, $83.88 for YouTube TV, $55.64 for our homeowner's warranty, which was a difference of $5. And I'm not sure if this went up. I'll have to check it. But we did order a new sign to go in the front yard. So I'm wondering if they charged us for that. But I will check that out. $28 for Terminex. $24.83 for Netflix, which was a difference of $0.23, cents, and $16.19 for Amazon Prime, which came up to a total of $388.32, which was an overage of $4.77. In our extras, we budgeted $500 for extra payment and $350 for our backup funds. That came up to $850. And in our actual, that's exactly what we put in. However, this these funds will not be used what they're intended to be used for. And again, I'll explain that at the end of the video. We budgeted $530 for our cash envelopes, $575 for our sinking funds, $150 for our challenges, $50 for our extra backup funds. They came up to $1,305. And in our actual category, we spent $485 on our cash envelopes, which was a difference of $45. $575 on our sinking fund, $150 on our savings challenges, and $50 in our extra backup funds. That came up to $1,260, which was a difference of $45. In our income versus our expenses, we estimate our income to be $2,861.45 minus the expenses of $383.55 minus the extras of $850 minus the cash envelopes of $530 minus the sinking funds of $575, minus the savings challenge of $150, and minus the extra backup fund of $50. That left a remainder of $322.90. In our actual category, our income was $2,861.45, minus the expenses of $388.32, which was an overage of $4.77, minus the extras of $850, minus the cash envelopes of $485, which was a difference of $45, minus the sinking fund of $575, minus the savings challenges of $150, and minus the extra backup funds of $50. That left a remainder of $363.18, which was a difference of $40.23. In our paycheck from June the 21st through June the 27th, in our expense category, we budgeted $367.67 for our phone bill, $115.52 for our life insurance, $37.55 for meds, $12.99 for Camera Pro, $7.62 for HP Inc., and $1.99 for Google Storage. That came up to a total of $553.37. Budgeted $490 for our cash envelopes, $350 for our sinking funds, $60 for our savings challenges, and $10 for our extra backup money. That came up to $910. In our income versus our expenses, we estimate our income to be $1,572.35 minus the expenses of $543.87 minus the cash envelopes of $490 minus the sinking funds of $350 minus the savings challenges of $60 and minus the extra backup money of $10. That left a remainder of $118.98. 
So fam, as you see, we did go over in a few areas, not by much, and I need to check it out to see if it was for a sign that we paid for or if they went up on the bill. I don't remember getting an email about it, but I will check it out. Also the extra payment and the backup funds, that will be put aside to go toward whatever expenses my brother may need um, in his final days. I have not sat down and told y'all what's going on with him, but my brother is critically ill and we are dealing with that right now. The money that is saved from this week, however, will be going toward our travel for the weekend of the 4th of July. We will be going down to pick up my mom. She's down there right now, so we're going to go pick her up. And that is going to our travel hotel room and eating our whatever we need to eat for the three days that we will be down there. Um, it's on either going to be three or four. We have not made up our mind yet, but that's what that money is going to go toward and probably in the next check as well. So that is what's going on with all the extra money that we have been putting away for backup funds and our extra payments. We have not been paying on debt because of this reason. We're trying to make sure that we have the extra money to do whatever we need to do with it and whatever's left will go toward our debt and back into the backup funds and extra payments. So if you've enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. I greatly appreciate it. And if you stuck around this long, please consider subscribing and joining the family. We'd love to have you. But that is all for this video, fam. Please like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the notification button so that you'll be notified next time I upload a video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, fam.